Good morning. Uh, my name is Julian Samson. I'm coming from the University of Antwerp, which is in Belgium. And we are doing air quality monitoring for many, many years now. And we publish very nice uh, papers on that. We obtain very nice results. But of course, nobody read this. We want to do something with, uh, together with the, the citizens of Antwerp because we think air quality is a, a topic of major importance. And some years ago, we launched the Air Basin Project. Now, the Air Basin Project is a very simple project. You just use strawberry plants and you give them to the citizens. They take care of the plants. And after some exposure time, they, they return the, the leaves to our lab and we analyze them. And we uh, can have an idea about the spatial variation of air quality in the city of interest, in our case it was Antwerp. Airbase became, became a, a huge success in uh, not only in Antwerp, but it was uh, well known all over Flanders. We even got uh, abroad to the Netherlands and to, to many other Flemish cities because the project is very uh, simple in its way, but it also gives uh, to the citizens data about the air quality in their region. And I think this is of major importance. And therefore, I'm so glad that this project can also start in uh, Zaragoza in Spain because air quality belongs, uh, is, a, is a topic of major importance for everybody because every minute of our life we, we only can breathe the air of the place where we are. So this air needs to be healthy and we need to know about this air quality. And just by participating to air basin or to the Spanish variant of this, uh, this project, you just can help improving the air quality in your city. And this is great. Thank you so much. So you will take care of your plants for, for many weeks. And uh, after some period, you will be asked to harvest your leaves and, and, and to, to wrap them nicely. And of course, you will, you will wonder what will happen with our leaves. Well, what we will do, the leaves will, set, will be sent to our uh, laboratory and we will analyze them magnetically. How does this work? So you can imagine that in, uh, in air quality, we, we have many particles uh, going around in the air. Many of them contain metals. If they deposit on the leaves, and if we bring the leaves in a magnetic field, they can remain magnetic. So we are looking to the magnetic character of these leaves, and the higher this magnetic character of the leaves is, the higher the air pollution is. And so this is what we're looking for, a very simple way, but very reliable and yields very good results.